The DSA award recognizes Mortonites who make exemplary contributions to the community and are held in esteem by their fellow citizens and peers. Congratulations. This year's DSA award winner is Jim Benkendorf. Well, I know you've tried to keep under the radar and behind the scenes, but when a good person does good things for the good of the community, you can't go very long without being unrecognized or unnoticed. Do you remember when we were in China? Oh yeah, it was awesome. I can't think of anybody that would be more deserving than Jim Benkendorf for the award. I just want to pass on congratulations from Pam and myself and from all of us at the CMFS group. He obviously deserves this award because uh, you might as well name it after him as far as I'm concerned after this year. A lot of people always thought there was just the two boys. I'm the middle child, so I'm the screwed up one. However, I didn't say that. I always said, no, I'm not the attorney, so I'm the same one. Like Jim was there surrounded by officers. He's like, <laughs> um, I could tell he had, he was like lawyering up. You oh, know, yeah. he was trying to talk his way out. Seriously, they didn't speak English, so you know, it was kind of funny. Yeah, I mean, he was going to be taken to jail to like Chinese prison or something. <laughs> Yeah. Those of you might not know this, but you know Jim's first name starts with a J, so does mine. Uh, Jim's last name starts with a B, so does mine. We both married women, uh, and we both like wine. And Jim, one of these days, we will get that trip to Napa. Jim Benkendorf embodies all of the things that we consider important in Morton. Commitment to the community, he works through his family, his church, his business, the Economic Development Council, and civic organizations for the betterment of the community. And I think he's had the same haircut for about 20 years, <laughs> which keeps him very youthful looking. Um, but again, he's just a man of, of, of integrity and he's just always so laid back, just cool, calm, and, and very collected. Jim's a, a very friendly, uh, soft-spoken man. He's intelligent, he understands what it takes to uh, help keep an organization going in the community and uh, he's, he's really a pleasure to work with. Jim is really a cheerleader of Morton. He does everything he can to make things better here and to bring business into town and to retain business also. Jim's an amazing guy who loves to give back to his community. He may come across very reserved and soft-spoken but he has an amazing sense of humor too. So, you know, after all that happened, um, we just have this poor, lonely little box. This is what the sword came in, and it's very empty, but we decided to bring it home anyway, because <laughs> it's all we had. <laughs> Jim is so involved in this community that I can't think of a more worthy person to receive this award. He is a great mentor to many people in the community, and he's been a great friend to so many people. Good-natured guy and um, he has done a tremendous amount of work for this community and I like to thank him for that. Jim is fun to be around. He always has a smile on his face, always laughing, uh, a great guy. He's always trying to help other people out. I think that Jim deserves this award because he puts in such long hours at the law firm. He would be totally justified to say, you know, I'm just so busy I don't have time to give back. But somehow he manages to squeeze out a few more hours in the day to give back to the village and I know that's because it's so important to him. It's the place where he grew up and also where he and Jane are raising their two sons. I remember that and I thought, you know, since Jim's getting this award, we should, you know, maybe find a sword for him. Oh yeah, to fill this box. So that'd be awesome. There's no one more deserving for this. Um, we're so proud of you, Jim. This is awesome for you and for your family. Jim is somebody who has made such an amazing difference in Morton in so many ways and oftentimes really behind the scenes. Okay, well this one, this one's kind of maybe, maybe that oh, would fit. That looks a little, little right side. Oh. Jim has a heart for Morton. He really loves his community. In my opinion, he has been the biggest cheerleader in a very behind the scenes way for the village of Morton. And I think that's why I admire him and enjoy working with him so much. This is, it's a little sad. <laughs> I think it was part of Aiden's Halloween costume, but. But you know, that is about the right look. See, see, that one there would, you go. That one would actually there fit in go. the box. That one fits in the box. I can't think of anyone who deserves this award more. So Jim, congratulations on being this year's DSA award winner. I think you've worked hard. I think you've worked for years and it couldn't come to someone who deserves it more. 
So again, congratulations to my baby brother, Jim. Just am so proud of you. I am just extremely happy that the town of Morton recognized you for everything that you've done because as I said before, you didn't do any of this for recognition. You did this because you care. Not quite Chinese. No, not quite Chinese. But, so I don't know, Jim, I'm so sorry. I guess we may not have the right sword for you. You might just have to keep the box. Congratulations, Jim, on this award. If there's anybody that deserves it, you do. For all the things that you do behind the scenes that nobody really knows about, uh, for all the help that you give, not only Morton, but the Chamber of Commerce. Uh, just really appreciate everything that you do. Congratulations. I've just got to thank you for your friendship and uh, there is just not a person that's uh, better suited for this. Congratulations. Jim, we thank you for giving up your sword so that we wouldn't have to go to jail. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Congratulations, Jim, on being this year's DSA Award winner. There's been many great things you've done for Morton and the best is yet to come, my friend. Thanks again on behalf of myself, on behalf of everyone um, that calls Morton home, that lives here, that works here. Thank you, Jim. Congratulations, Congratulations Jim. We love you.